from Mark and Grace Size with Noble Notary and Legal Document Preparers again. <laughs> we are back again and we are going to talk about how to pick the right notary directory. Now, I know we did one on directories before and we said that we had our own directory that was forthcoming that was in the process of being built. And I kind of told you some of the good ones and I kind of told you some of the ones that aren't necessarily worth it. But we're going to explain today exactly how to know that, how to, to, how to determine whether they're good or not. And of course, we're going to talk about our directory. So let's tell you and a little bit about that. Why it's so great. Why it's going to be so why great. Why it's going to be great. <laughs> so we have or excuse me, noblelegalpros.com. Now what actually inspired us to create this directory was all the poor directories out there. The, and the everybody, service, everybody right? kept asking us, when are you coming out with a directory? There was a demand for it, so we're really excited to launch this for you guys. So this directory will have blogs and it will have videos and of course it will have your listings. Now let's talk about those listings because most listings only let you, they're very limited. It's like, you're a notary, right? So we are going to, <laughs> yeah. So we, and then if you were in another service, you'd have to go to a different directory. So we are covering legal services, financial services, and real estate services. Now those are master categories and each of those has subcategories that you can pick. Tons. I mean, the list goes on and on, which is really cool because we haven't found any directory quite like the directory that we have created with all of the subcategories. So as you know, we teach you to be um, a one-stop shop. You, you want to have all of these items that you can offer, all of these services you can offer your clients. Um, and so now you can go into our directory and you can list all those, all those out. Um, now there will be, it'll be multi-tiered, right? So we're going to have three different levels um, at different prices if you want to talk about so that. that. Is, so there's going to be bronze and there's going to be silver and gold. Now presently, and I'm going to explain why, but presently you can get a free listing on the bronze category, which is would be what we call tier three, meaning that you're gonna somebody who has a paid spot's gonna rank higher than you. At some point, we're gonna limit the we're gonna limit the number of gold members, meaning that gold member. Um, we're gonna limit the number of gold per city because we don't want to saturate a directory. Of okay. Course, yes. Um, so there will be that we will limit the number of people that can sign up in certain demographics, but. So the gold would come in first place and they would have the most options. They can pick up to 10 of their subcategories. Yep. The silver can pick five subcategories. Now the free, I think I've got it to where they're only two cat. So you can pick your main category and a subcategory below that, which is still pretty good. Yeah, and so the bronze even is, gosh, so it's less than less than a quarter a day? No, no bronze is free for now. Oh, bronze, sorry. It I'm will be a flat silver. lifetime fee yes. at one point and I'm gonna tell you why. So silver a is gonna be less than 25 cents per day. And then the gold edition is going to be less than 50 cents a day, which is nothing to ever have this advertisement for you. Now, with the gold and the silver, you have the ability to post videos, to post your own blogs, uh, stuff that will help gravitate, help people to gravitate more towards your own listing. Aside from that preferred status, this directory also is designed to function like a landing page, meaning it's going to show up in your local search. What we've done is we have, and this is why we're going to, the free listing by the end of April will probably be a pay, a one-time paid for lifetime membership, a paid listing. And that's because we've hired, we have what's called on-site SEO and off-site SEO. So on-site SEO, I'm pretty much handling it. It's kind of automated. Off-site SEO is where I hire people to go out, reach out to a bunch of different, um, just a bunch of different sites and ask them to feature it and to backlink to it and to build it up. This is something, this is the fail with most directories. And I'm going to show you how, I'm going to show you how to figure that out. I'm going to show you how to size up other directories to determine whether they're worth your money or not. Okay. I'm going to show you that because there's a lot of directories out there that, yeah, they're a directory, but nobody knows or cares. Right. And People are paying to be in this directory and they're ranking very, very low, which Mark they're not show even you. Ranked, they're right? very, so. nobody's even seeing this listing. So we're offering something for you guys that we promise is going to rank. Very page, high right. because that's what we specialize in. That's that's what we push for you guys is make sure you're seen um, nationwide. Really, this is going to be nationwide, which is going to be really really right. cool. Right. So multiple categories: legal shield, credit repair, fingerprinting, apostilles, wedding officiants, online um, notary, 
Um, if you're in insurances, whether you're an adjuster or a mortgage estate, broker yeah. or a real estate agent, if you got any of those other side gigs or that's your main gig, you'll be able to list that too. Uh, so that's it. That's the call to action here is to go sign up for free now or get a paid spot. Uh, the paid prices are probably going to stay the same indefinitely, but the free one by the end of April, our offsite guy is going to have this site to where it's it's built to rank, meaning it's going to be visible no matter what. So, so. you're going to want to get in there right now, today. Um, NobleLegalPros.com. While it's free right now, guys, before we, I mean, we're going to make this huge. We're going to make this huge. So. so now with that, let me show you exactly how, so you know that we're not talking crap. Let me show you how to size up directories, including ours, so that you can know that you're making the right decision when you're picking a directory. As if it, if it doesn't sound good enough already. Okay, let me show you. Okay, gang, so let me show you how to size up a directory. And uh, I'm not gonna throw anybody under the bus, but I am going to show you how to know what you're looking for. Now, there's two ways you can do this. Um, one is you could go to Moz and you could get their toolbar, their Chrome extension, which is what you're looking at right here. This is a Moz Chrome extension. And it gives you a site's different ratings. It gives you, um, PA score and a DA. So these are like domain authority, page authority, and it gives you the number of links going back to it. Okay. That is one tool you can use. Another tool that you can use is a refs and they have what they call a free backlink checker and they give you a domain authority or page authority. So you could use either or uh, the, the, the Chrome extension is really easy if you're just popping site to site to site. But with this one, you would manually enter in a site and it's going to tell you their domain authority, which is basically what Google thinks about their website. Okay, so if Google doesn't think much about it, then it's not going to be very seen. But if Google thinks much about it, <clears throat> it has that high DA, PA, DR, uh, then it's going to be, you can expect it's going to be highly visible. It's going to get traffic. Okay, those are just the facts the way they really are. So I'm going to show you a few directories and you can draw your own conclusions about whether or not they're worth putting your money into. And so let me just, first of all, let me just establish a couple of things. Okay. Let me just back up my claims. All right. So here we go. This is one of our sites. This is ladybirdd.net. This is a site that we own that gets us lots of traffic. We prepare legal documents. One of them is a ladybird deed. We make a lot of money doing this. Okay. This site, as you can see, has a PA of 44, a DA of 56. It's telling you on this main site here, this main landing page, 2,160 backlinks going to this page. Now, I have one blog on this site. This site is an opt-in. It's made for us to generate leads. And it's mainly a click the call. But <clears throat> I have one blog on this page, and that is this blog called All About the Mysterious Enhanced Life Estate Deeds. And if you go to the blog page where I wrote all about, you know, detailed about it, you can see PA of 39, DA of 56, 203 links going back to this one blog. Because if you write a very long, very thorough and very informative blog, people will just want to share it. Okay, that's a reality. So let me show you our, now this site is, is a year old. I've only had this site for one year. All right, now let me show you our main site, legal.prepnotary.com, which is our, you know, where our business is. And if you go here, you can see off the main site, a PA of 45, a DA of 56, 4,913 links coming back to this main page. Let's go to one of our blogs. Okay, let me show you a blog. Here's a blog we wrote. Uh, this is uh, a notary PDF manuals and handbooks and resources by state. So in other words, if you wanted to go to this blog, it basically shows you where to get the training manuals or the state reference manuals for every state. Obviously, pretty popular blog, PA41, DA56, 479 links going back to that one page, okay? And you could go through my whole entire website and find that it's going to be, it's going to remain consistent, and it ranks very well. We rank very well even on our landing pages, which are, you have what's called an area map. So an area map is um, all the different, uh, all the different, uh, places that you would show up, all your different services. So um, that area, let me find it. I might have gotten rid of it. I got rid of that. Oh, there it is, area. Okay, I'm to my footer. So if you go to the area map, and let's just pick like the land. 
And Deland is giving us uh, 56, 39, 234 backlinks just going to this Deland page, okay? So this is to show you our directory is going to do this exact thing. It's going to have the services and then the cities for all the listings. So let me just show you again. Let me, I, I mean, I guess I'm picking on some people. Let me show you a good one, okay? Notary Stars is good. They have got a great site, but a PA of 32, a DA of 17 with 34 links. Okay, on their main page, on their home, on their home page. So, and they're actually a good directory. I've actually say they're a good directory. <clears throat> so let me show you. Um, let me show you some other ones. This one is called the RonNotaryDirectory.com. Now, this is actually another YouTuber who has a directory for Rons, apparently, and it's actually probably using the same server that I'm using, the same directory sleeve that I'm using. Just built out it a little bit differently and again different understanding of what to do and how to build these up a pa of 12 a da of one with seven links okay <clears throat> let me show you another one this is called the notary connects.com a pa of one a da of one zero links on their main page okay so you can draw your own conclusions about those directories now i know you're saying well wait a minute mark what about your directory well Okay, my directory is one week old, folks. Okay, it's a couple days old. PA is six, DA is five, two links. That, by the end of the month of April, will not be the case. This will be absolutely like all of our other sites that I've showed you. It will have thousands and thousands of links. And like Notary Stars, it will have tons of blogs and it will have <clears throat> vlogs or video articles. And there will be all the different listings. So here is our directory, Noble Legal Pros. And like I said, you have multiple categories that you can pick from with multiple options in those categories. For example, if we picked a member, you know, like myself, um, and we looked at this, you can see the um, you can see the different services that are listed under that profile. So if we go to view listing here and um, specialties, so specialties, you've got Apostilles, credit repair, fingerprinting, legal document preparation, legal shield, signing agent, mobile notary, notary, notary permit runner, RON notary, tax preparation, wedding official, all those different categories that you have that you now show up for. So if somebody is like wedding efficient near me, boom, pops up because Google's there's a map in this listing. So Google's going to know exactly where you are uh, right here. See, there's a map pin. There's a Google map pin. So Google's going to know where you are and Google's going to know those services. So if somebody's looking for a mobile notary, or a remote online notary, or a tax preparer, or a credit credit repair specialist, or fingerprinting, or apostilles in this particular area near them, it's going to show up. This is going to show up. It's going to act as a landing page where they can click the call. They can send. They can fill out a contact form. So this is <clears throat> the this is the reason why we created this directory. I wanted to one make it on par with notary stars, maybe even be better than them, maybe be the premier directory for notaries, for legal services, for financial services and real estate services and help you to generate leads. Uh, <clears throat> invariably in our business, we do, we're kind of what we call a small signing service. And we may expand that signing, signing services to be nationwide. Right now, we just kind of do it regionally, basically having notaries do some of the legal documents that we have that we don't really want to drive out to. So, uh, but we may expand that out more. And of course, we'll use our directory to pool other notaries uh, for hire. So, but so Notary Stars, pretty good one. A PA of 26, that's pretty formidable. Um, <clears throat> obviously, both our websites and even the blogs on our main websites that uh, aren't really that old, you know, a couple years old, ladybirddeed.net, less than a year old, I have <clears throat> a massive amount of exposure and a massive amount of links and a massive amount of traffic. And we, of course, are going to do the same thing with uh, Noble Legal Pros. So let me show you Arif's real quick, how you would do that. So if we took um, Notary Stars, and we could also we could paste it in here. We could look at it on RFs if you didn't want to get that toolbar. And it is going to give you a quick report, a quick summary. And it says that their overall domain rating, their DR of 48, pretty impressive um, with four backlinks, which is not impressive at all. Um, but I do know that they show up very well. They rank very well in local searches. I have determined that myself. And then, of course, we my intent is to outrank them and is to outrank all the other 
notary and legal service directories so that you can get traffic and you can get leads for far less than anybody else is wanting to charge you. Uh, let's just pick on somebody again real quick and then I'm going to let you guys get out of here. Um, again, I, I, I'm, I'm just trying to show you the educate how to size it up. You can take any directory out there, any website for that matter, and you can just run them through these and you can get the report on them. So this particular one, wah, 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 wah. but if you looked at sites that I built in the past, um, and you know I've shown you two out of three sites that I built, and if you look at those, you can know that the same process is ongoing for the one I have right now. Go oh, cha ching 32,000 backlinks total. So, cha ching, um, that's from content creation, that's from hiring professionals, that's from investing in that business and investing in that website, uh, which I fully intend on doing for uh, noblelegalpros.com. All right, so that is it for today. I hope you found that information useful. You can take that and use that, and you can vet and qualify any kind of notary director or any kind of directory for that matter. All right, guys, God bless. We'll see you next time.